Hey there guys and welcome to my YouTube channel The Indian Jugars and today I'll be discussing about the topic resistors. Now, what is a resistor you might ask? A resistor is a passive two terminal component that implements electrical resistance as a circuit component. Resistors are used to reduce voltage levels, limit current flow, adjust signal levels and divide voltages as well as bias active components. Now for those of you guys who don't know what a resistor looks like, resistor looks like this. These are its two terminals and this is the body of the resistor with some color coding as you can see. This color coding tells us about the resistance of the resistor. We'll be talking about that later in the video. Now, in a circuit diagram, a resistor looks like this. The resistance of the resistor is denoted in ohms which is denoted by this symbol. Now how to connect a resistor in a simple circuit. So let's draw a simple circuit. Now this is a simple circuit consisting of a battery, a load, light bulb, a resistor and a switch. So when we turn on the switch, the current flows from the positive terminal to the resistor and then to the light bulb and then comes back to the battery. Now assume that this is a 6 volt lamp and this is a 12 volt battery. So what will happen? The bulb will blow up. In order to prevent that, a resistor is used with the bulb in series to protect the bulb. As a result, a 6 volt bulb works fine on a 12 volt supply. Now in case of fusible resistors, if the load draws too much current from the circuit, the resistor will blow up, hence protecting everything else in the circuit. There is an another type of resistor which is known as the variable resistor which looks like this. So this is how the variable resistor is denoted in a circuit diagram and in the real world it looks like this. This is a regulator. Fan regulators that you use daily to control the speed of your fan consists of one of these inside them. Now let's have a look what's inside this resistors. So a resistor consists of two ceramic layers, a high resistive wire is wound over the first layer and then a second coating of the same ceramic layer is added. Now, from the Ohm's law this can be concluded that the resistance of this wire times the length of this wire results in the resistance of this resistor. What's inside a variable resistor? Variable resistor looks like this from the inside. These are its three terminals. One terminal is connected to the source and the other terminal is connected to the load. And this terminal in some cases might be connected to the ground. So basically this terminal is connected to a resistive wire the tip of this terminal touches the resistive wire and this terminal can be moved along this whole section of the wire. The tip of this terminal is touching the wire at this point the resistance is very low and when the terminal moves from here to here or say here the resistance increases. So let's have a practical demo. Now for the demo I will be using this breadboard.
so as you can see the LED is working fine and as soon as I take out this resistor the LED stops working this was connected in series with the LED so I again connect it till low yes now let's try the variable resistor so let's unhook it and plug it in and as you can see the LED lights up so now I will try to dim the brightness of the LED by turning this knob and as you can see this works flawlessly So So when I turn the knob this side this terminal slides this way like this So the length of the resistive wire decreases and the resistance also decreases now let's talk about the color coding of the resistors so as you can see there are four rings on this resistor of different colors the first one is brown the second one is black and the third one is orange while the fourth one is silver so the first one resembles 1, the second one black resembles 0 and the third one resembles the multiplier 3 zeros and the fourth one resembles its tolerance is plus minus 10% in this case. So this is 1, this is 0 that means 10 into three three zeros that means 10,000 or 10 kilo ohm resistor so guys this is the table of the color coding of the resistors for remembering the table there is a shortcut which is As you can see the sentence BB Roy of Great Britain has a very good wife. Yes, this is the trick to remember the table. First B resembles black which is 0. The second B resembles brown which is 1. This R resembles red which is 2. This O resembles orange. 3 Y resembles 4 G resembles green 5 This B resembles blue which is 6 This V resembles violet which is 7 This G resembles grey which is 8 And this white resembles 9 and for the fourth ring there are two colors only silver and gold if on any resistor there is gold ring that means the resistor's tolerance will be plus minus five percent and if there is a silver ring it will be plus minus ten percent suppose this is a resistor with four rings the first one is brown the second one is black the third one is blue and the fourth one is silver 
द रेजिस्टर्स रेजिस्टेंस विल बी एज यू कैन सी इन दिस रेजिस्टर देर आर फोर रिंग्स ब्राउन ब्लैक ब्लू एंड सिल्वर सो फॉर नाउ लेट्स कीप दिस सिल्वर रिंग असाइड एंड देर आर थ्री रिंग्स द फर्स्ट वन ब्राउन विच मीन्स वन एज यू कैन सी हियर सो आई विल राइट हियर वन द सेकेंड वन इज ब्लैक विच मीन्स जीरो and the third one is the multiplier which is blue in this case that means blue 6 so there will be six zeros after this 10 so the resistance will be 10000000 which means 10 mega ohms that will be the resistance of this resistor and this silver ring resembles plus minus 5% tolerance so that's it for now guys if you have gained some knowledge watching this video or even if you have enjoyed this video please give me a like do share and subscribe my youtube channel